I think agents that don't embrace technology, there's also two types of agents in that category. There is agents who don't embrace technology who really need technology, and there's agents who don't embrace technology who are going to be super successful even in the face uh, you know, of technology because there is still such a social component. Now, I would argue that agents who don't need technology are probably missing out on a whole other level you know, of success um, and not reaching and maximizing you know, their full potential. I'm a great example of that. The more and more I embraced technology over time, I realized early on in my career, there were a lot of deals I missed out on that, you know, just as I implement different forms of technology, different clients keep coming, you know, coming back. Uh, you know, but that said, the, the biggest hurt is gonna be the agents who are new in their career, who are just up and coming and could really, really benefit from these types of things and leaning into it over time because there's such a compound interest effect that if you haven't put the work in over many, many years, and it's little things, one or two deals in the course of a year and multiply that out over an agent's career can make huge differences in income, referrals, many different things. So technology is important. Um, to be fair, there's always gonna be a subsect of agents who you know, are at a good level and they just don't know that extra potential they're missing out on. But for a lot of people, uh, it could serve them very well.